Hi beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. The fact that you chose to click on this video means a lot to me. Thank you very much. Today's video is full of satisfying cleaning motivation. I'm deep cleaning for the first time ever on camera my kitchen. I hope you like it and I hope it gives you some kind of motivation. The first thing I did was remove the spiders from all corners. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to film it. I don't even know why. Then I used the sponge with liquid dishwashing soap. First I used a microfiber cloth or a cleaning towel, but it wasn't doing much. Then I later used the sponge and then used the cleaning towel to clean the surface. But if you don't want to use this method, you can use multi-purpose foam cleaner. Spray the surface, leave it there for a few minutes before you can clean it off with a cleaning towel. So let me know if you give up hope. Do I leave you alone or I leave you alone? So let me know if you give up hope by now. So let me know if you give up hope. Do I leave you alone or leave you alone? All I need is 10 more minutes, 10 more minutes with you Let me give it all one last shot, will I ever get through to you? All I need is 10 more minutes, 10 more minutes with you Let me give it all one last shot, will I ever get through to you? How am I wasting my time, should I leave for the night, it's something like the moment the next thing I'm doing is dusting the windows. I will still use the dishwashing liquid with a cleaning towel to clean all the window drills. The grease will eventually come off easily.
I'm on to the cupboards now. If you have an organized system that you follow, it is going to be easy for you to deep clean in here. I'm handling one cupboard at a go. I will remove all the items, clean the surface, and before I return them, I'm going to place dining mats here to protect the food containers from dust, grease, and spills. Then I will clean the containers before returning them. I will also use my malt purpose foam cleaner to clean the doors and the door handles. Or if you have disinfectant wipes, you can also use them. Unfortunately, it was hard to get a good camera angle here, but I was still using the multi-purpose foam cleaner with a cleaning towel, trying to reach those deep corners and clean them as much as I can. Oh, 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 oh,
Now it's time for the appliances. If you have a microwave, it's time to clean it. I don't have one, so I'll be cleaning the top of my fridge and then I'll also wipe off those little hands. I will clean my cooker stove and then my rice cooker. Then I will clean the backsplash and wipe it with a clean towel. If you have a disinfectant, remove everything and spray nicely. Like the top is done I'm on to the bottom I don't have a pantry as you can see so I keep some of my food in my cupboards and one of them on the extreme far left really needed a deep clean and I also use this opportunity while cleaning to check some of my foods expiry dates and those that have been open for too long
The last part of cleaning is always the floor, so I'm going to sweep and mop. I will also clean the dustbin and leave it in the sun to dry. Did you know that the sun is a natural disinfectant? And also let me know what your favorite part of the video is so far. video i am extremely tired if you have enjoyed it please give it a like and subscribe for more of these videos until next time god bless you stay safe i love you bye